Michelle Abraham has everything you need to know, from local leads and celebrity interviews to trending topics and more. Right now on Good Day Stateline. Hi and welcome to Good Day Stateline. It's Wednesday, April 5th. We are so excited tonight kicking off the show with two of the stars of Fox's A Farmer Wants a Wife, Ryan Black and Hunter Grayson. How are you guys? Doing good. How are doing you? Good. Yeah, doing been, great. Uh, you've been real busy dating a bunch of ladies on your farms. Hunter, you still have five ladies left. Ryan, you are down to four. Uh, let's start with you, Ryan. How does it feel to date so many women at once? <laughs> <laughs> um, I guess I have to watch how I answer this. Um, <laughs> nah, I think it's... Um, it's it's an experience. I, honestly, you learn so much about yourself, really, and you learn how to communicate. And they show you so many different things. You know, you learn their perspectives and and their personalities and their emotional um, vibes and their energy and stuff. So, truthfully speaking, having all of those personalities um, at, at once, you really do learn a lot. Um, I'm definitely not going to take away from that. And it is so uh, against the norm. So you have that factor as well, but then you know you you know everyone knows what they signed up for. We kind of know what we're getting ourselves into. Um, so you come into it and you you want to be open. You want to accept it and let it flow. And, um, and, and instead of being so against it, so I can't act as if um, we didn't join us and, and and like wow, I, I didn't really <laughs> want to experience dating five girls at one time because we knew that coming in, but just. I guess that a good positive takeaway is so much um, growth and internal and emotional growth that you get from it, uh, just experiencing the life with all these different personalities and character traits and everything. For sure. Hunter, how did you find yourself on this show? <laughs> um, opened an Instagram message from a casting <laughs> company, I guess, is what started it off. Um, <laughs> Yeah, have been waiting there for you for you like know, ever. <laughs> no, I was actually, I, I, okay, so weird story. I was on the way up to a horse sale and I my phone pinged and I couldn't find the thing. I'm not very tech savvy, but something about request. And I said, oh, request. So I opened it up and it was that. <laughs> uh, I, and that was the way it was. And I, uh, the horse I ended up buying at that sale came from Alan's neighbor. Oh, that's so funny. You guys have so much going on. Um, I know that Ryan, your mom, is joining tonight's episode. You got to figure out if you want to keep the ladies pretty soon. Uh, Hunter, you are going to have to send some women home at some point. I know we can't really like ask you what happens next, but if you can give me one word to describe how you're feeling right now, start with Ryan and then Hunter. Let us know. Anxious. <laughs> you can't take my word, dang it. <laughs> <laughs> Apprehensive. That's a that's a different word that means anxious. It means the same thing. I'm we are running out of time, but it was so nice to chat with you both. We can't wait to follow along and see what happens next. All right. Thank you guys. Tonight's episode of A Farmer Wants a Wife is called Tears, Tantrums, and Tailgates. You can catch it right here on Fox 39 Wednesdays at 8 p.m. We'll be right back with Brian and Alicia from Life Balance Medical Center.